Okay. Wait, no. Oh! There we go. God, I don't know why it breaks every time. Oh, and I am nowhere near prepared. <laughs> uh, you cannot understand how unprepared I am. That's booped me. I am so sorry. Uh, did OBS decide to go, hmm. Let's default the uh the mic again. So when I realized the mic was it <laughs> Oh for Pete's sake. <sighs> Hold on. Literally I just started. I have a whole drink with me. Uh okay, let me get my model up. YouTube Studio. Uh honestly. I'm gonna have make it so that get a cuppa is like a hundred points. <laughs> there we go. Oh, uh, no, uh, a thousand, Zerf, a thousand. Uh, the community challenges. Uh, no, Ugh, a thousand guys. Ugh. But yeah, the community challenges are for the Apex stream uh, Monday. Uh, any challenges that get completed get put into the... Uh, that actually get added into the world or the uh, campaign. 
it's take D and D, but make it werewolves. <laughs> And I call it the Apex Predator Stream, or Apex, because that's the name of the campaign. Now, I'll be right back again, because Zerf demanded tea. So I'll be right back. <laughs> And I have returned. Which do you want to go for? Uh, okay. Hmm. I personally don't mind overall. Uh, perhaps Ga Gaia's arsenal because uh, we're technically supposed to be like warriors for Gaia and all that sh uh, stuff. So, but uh. See you around, sir. Thanks for looking. Okay. <sighs> Thank you. I need to recalibrate my thing because I haven't used my thing in like forever. Ah, no, wrong thing. There we go. Uh, right, seven's the calibrate. Cool. There we go. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Load game. Let's hope I have the internet capacity for this. I should. I should. Now I have a snack to go with me over this because I like to go to stream for this snack. And for some, it's not like I need to have my hands on the keyboard oh, the entire time. Wow. Ooh. Thank you, so uh, thank you, Frost. Did we do this? Hey, hey. Let's play them. I appreciate the point.
Time to cheat. Oh goodness. I only have 11%. Shoot. Got so many fucking notifications on my phone. Because I don't touch my phone the entire day. Question seven answer. Okay, Japanese. It's just Japanese. Sash Obi, I know that one. No. There we go. All right. I see. Nice. Yay. I'm already level three, so it's fine. <laughs> Points of knowledge are really good. Slap. Nice. Let's make some. Okay. Let's make some stuff. Uh, we have fourteen, but it's always good to make more. Yeah. Absolutely. Let's go. Yes. Yeah. I mean, I don't need the proficiency, but nice. you know. <laughs> I haven't got my hands, apparently. <laughs> yeah. Well then. Ugh. I don't think I'm a stay. I just wanted to stay to pop in and say hi and waste all my points. Fair enough. Well, if you stay, uh, feel free to just like lurk. But eh, see you around then. Isn't that a detective? What? Oh yeah, all the detective stuff. I think I'm gonna be meeting a catchy soon, honestly. Calling cards into the Madarami exhibit, do you think? I was wondering yeah, I think it's like one of the thing. It's like the one sent to Kamishida. The people online are saying the fan thieves are behind this. Cool. There's already a fan site with a weird- with a bunch of requests posted on it. <laughs> so Can't cool. believe they're real life superheroes. It's happened twice, it's probably going to happen next. Well, it'll happen again, I can't wait to see who's next. I'm crazy girl running. Yes. Sounds like a lot of people are going on that trip tomorrow. Do you guys want to see the show too? Or am I seeing that? I like talk shows. Ooh, and variety shows. Hold up. I feel like there's a question here. I wonder if they're talking about the Phantom Thieves. They'll definitely get plenty of attention on the TV and the internet. Hmm. Though I'm a little worried what might happen if the media gets people too riled up. Moving the mic to the side. There we go. That reminds me, have you guys covered total, total literatinism yet? That word is a governmental is a governmental mental structure that unites its people under single ideology and authoritation control of the masses. 
In theory, it, begins, it brings people together under one ideal. So when it comes with logistical beliefs, but it also means forcing pe ideals on people, assimily assimilating the unwilling. And that's how wars get started. How about you? Hold up, I am catching up. I'm catching up. Six, six seven, six, eight. What did, what does this word take things a step further? Step further than authority to that word. Um controlling public thought. This is it. Exactly. Oh, wow, well I'm surprised you knew that. Yes, uh, this kind of government tries to control the culture, morals, and even thoughts of its people. To minimize, uh, to minimize dissonance, they try to assimilate everyone into one ideology. Even reading the room can be seen as a form of personal assimilation. You all do that too, right? I try to, though I'm not great at it. I'm not, it's not a bad skill to have, it can even help you survive the modern world. But you can't do it too much. If you make an echo chamber, then people whose opinions differ might get hurt. Extra knowledge. So, I'd like to remind you all to keep a strong sense of self and open mind, so we can disagree and still live in harmony. I guess class is almost over. That's it for today. Mm. Strong sense of self, huh? I need to make sure we don't lose sight of what we believe in, too. Yeah, good job. Aww. Principal's trying to get info on the students. Why do you think he's doing that? It's probably because of Mr. Kamashita, right? Considering what happened with Suzuki-san. Huh? I heard Principal Kobayakawa knew about the sexual harassment too, and just turned a blind eye to it. I bet he wants to snuff out any rumors now. Even the volleyball team was told to keep quiet. That's the worst! So that's what he's using Mijibis Senpai for? <laughs> Oh yeah, rumor has it she knew as well. Isn't that horrible? Chick's all noble about it too. Nijima Senpai knew? <laughs> Knowing um Makoda, I don't think she actually knew what though. What is the meaning of this, Principal Kobayakawa? Why did you post that notice? It was all for your sake. I thought the more information you had, the easier your investigation would become. And? Did any information arise about the case I asked you to look into? Nothing yet. I will pass the details along if anything comes up. Right now, there is a more pressing issue. It appears there are students at Shuchen who are being threatened by a criminal organization. Uh. A student who saw your posting came to us looking for help. I'd like to request a countermeasure. Isn't this some sort of mistake? I can't believe this would happen to the students of our academy. Now is no time for such problems. There is still lingering concern regarding the phantom thieves. Oh my goodness, kids but are being harmed. For help. Yeah. I'm rather busy at the moment. If you wish to do something, you will need to act on your own. Sir, are you sure about this? I'm still investigating your case as well. Yes, that's correct. It works out perfectly. My intentions have borne fruit. This criminal organization must be the connecting factor. If you pursue this criminal issue, you'll surely find clues about the Phantom Thieves. But that's absurd. So, let's say this rumor is true. Do you intend to ignore those students in trouble? Then fucking help her then, you daft cunt. Your sister would have solved this easily if she were in your position. Yeah, because she's an adult. My expectations of you are very high. I hope you don't disappoint. She's a fucking ad she's a fucking child. Her sister's an adult and a trained attorney or prosecutor. Yeah, she'd be able to solve this within five minutes of, like, looking at everything. She's trained to do so! She works with detectives, goddamn! This is, like, a 16, 17-year-old. What the fuck? Oh, what is this? Uh, what kind of 
person would be bigger than Madarame. Wonder, how do you someone who's took of the town? Do I have any specific idea? A crooked politician. Ah, yes, that line. That is an interesting line of thought. Either way, we need a lead before we can begin anything. Just have to look for that as we go. If only there was a big target li just lying around for us. Phil tomorrow's field trip is to the TV station. Maybe our next target will be a celebrity. Maybe. Right. Um. I don't really do anything today. Ooh. Hello. Hell yeah. Yes. Absolutely. Sip of tea. I think that this tea is too weak. I mean, I did kind of rush it. I think that's good. Not bad, Coot. Not bad, Senpai. You're pretty flexible. And you catch on so fast. My body is aching just from mimicking Casimir's poses. Ah. It's all about harmony between internal and external oblique muscles. I can't get enough of it. Ah, uh, um, <laughs> we're just getting started. Go easy with me. I think it's we're just getting started, but I'm gonna check because I forgot to go. Um, hold on, hold on. Kasumi. We're just getting started. <laughs> I was right. I knew it. Feisty. Well, feisty, are we? Glad to hear it. Uh, Alright, let's continue. I had stretched with Kasumi. I'm dying. I think that's enough stretching for now. Good effort. And uh, I'd like to continue with our training, but. I'm not doing so great at the moment. I'm not sure I can marry, manage anything too strenuous. Uh, next time, then. Thank you for understanding. I uh, was thinking. Do you prefer have somewhere to talk to you about something? I've been feeling like I'm stuck in this slump. No matter how much I practice, I just can't get any better. I went to my coach to talk about it, but she told me to take some time off from gymnastics. According to her, I really need to think. I really. According to her, I need to think about who I really am. The idea is not stopping. The idea is not to stop doing gymnastics. Just she wants me to take a break. I see. I've never had an issue that practice couldn't solve, but now I have no idea what to do. So uh, I want you to help me. You know. Uh. Even if we're not doing gymnastics, we still go keep going out with me. No problem. Are you sure? Uh, romantically? No problem. Thank you so much. We'll go in the platonic route, obviously. Thank you so much. Uh, I've heard my coach praising me. She says Kasumi's greatest weapon has always been her baldness. And honestly, I that used to be true. I was told I was totally fearless, confident. Gymnastics was a fun challenge. But since I started high school, I've been in this slump. I got taller for one, and there were some other complications. I can't move how I want anymore. Like, it's not even my own body. I kind of fell into depression. It got pretty bad. But... But when you came, but when you helped me in Shibuya, something occurred to me. When I saw how fearless you are, how confident you are, I knew you were the right one for the job. If I stick with you, Senpai, I think I can get learn how to be confident again. Uh... Leave it to me. Yes. Great, thank you. You're a strange one. I didn't think you'd accept. Well, I'll try and return the, f the favor through our deal. Yay, rank two. Tumbling allows you to avoid being surrounded by enemies in a palace. Nice. Literally just like rolling on the floor. If a shadow attacks you head on in a palace, you'll be able to avoid being surrounded by enemies and turn the situation into a normal encounter or an ambush. 
Nice! Oh, excuse me. I should get going. I have a meeting with I'll my be coach. Home now. I need to get going for the day, but I'll make sure you don't break you don't regret this. Thanks to casting me training, I feel like my stamina increased. Alright. Hey, HP. Katsumi rushed off into the distance. I should get my belongings and head home. Thank you very much for joining me today. Are you feeling sore after all that? You play stress on muscles that you don't use very often. Please remember to massage them out before you go to sleep. I'm glad you accepted my request. I feel so relieved I suddenly got so really hungry that my stomach wouldn't stop growling in my meeting. Impressive! <laughs> Thank you very much, though I don't know if that's really worth my any praise. An excessive diet tends to make people feel sick, but it seems to have the opposite effect on me. But since you're helping me out, I'll do whatever it takes to maintain my shape. I hope you can help me out next time. I'll be reaching out again soon. Well, I'll talk to you soon. Bye, Kasumi. Ah, you're back. Oh, all the TV station stuff. That's fun. Uh, you're in Tokens. Uh, you're absolutely right. Sure. The phrasing has uh, quite the immoral ring to it. Did you always react to the weirdest stuff? You know how to observe a live recording of a show, right? Oh, maybe we're gonna be on TV. Just be in the crowd, remember? And any TV appearance would be for like two seconds. Uh, hmm, try to pull any fanciful stunts to kind of attention, okay? Ooh, can we hang out with you? you got time right now? No, decline. Next time, then. Okay, it's not raining, but I think I'm gonna do coffee. Because I need charm. Oh, uh, right. Hmm? There we go. Some coffee. Yo. We're gonna need coffee eventually. <laughs> coffee. Yes. All right. Even though I don't actually fucking drink it. Charm. Here, I'll have a sip. Mm. Ethiopian mocha hala. Hara. Harara. Harara. <laughs> mocha is a port town in the, Republic of, in the Republic of Yemen, where both Yemeni coffee and Ethiopian mocha harar are exported. Coffee in this region was given a moniker, mocha, Mocha coffee has a unique spicy flavor and a strong aroma with blackberry notes. Oh, here's me thinking that a mocha coffee is just chocolate and coffee. <laughs> uh, not bad. It's worth the compliments. Yay. Maybe it's fate your baggage seems to follow you wherever you go. I guess everything, good or bad, was meant to happen. I'm not usually one to believe that crap. Then, would you come here be fate too? Ha, this isn't like me, but I hope our chance meeting turns out to be something good. I know, I know, rambling old men aren't popular. Anyway, thanks for the coffee. Aww. <laughs> well then. <sighs> it looks like everything's going pretty good. Quickly checking something. Oh, what's going on? Oh boy. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Cool. Okay. Oh, I can't believe- I think I forgot to ask. How's everyone's uh, evening going? And I think I completely forgot to ask. To help make TV shows. 
I'm sure you know about Oh yeah, this, this is boring. Well, those are actually <laughs> sponsor related product placements. Yeah, how's everyone this day going? Because may as well talk the chat while the plot is happening. Everyone <laughs> huh. knows that this is interesting. Snore. He ain't even listening. <laughs> For example, soap opera reruns are shown in the day, whereas alluring newswomen are broadcast at night. Thus, the scheduling department is where we decide what time we broadcast. Oh, my teeth really good. I like temperature you could say wise. It's the place where the scheduling is determined. Can this get any more obvious? So sleepy. <laughs> Not even listening to what I said. So, the best parts are taken from the footage in order to cut down the program to the desired length. The place where this filmed footage is edited would be the editing room. Hey, how much longer does this go? I swear, I'm not gonna fast. <laughs> What's going on? I <laughs> just twirled. He's like, whoa. Too sleepy to like fucking. Sit. My apologies. I'll have them leave right away. Now then, it's time for a bit of hands-on experience. We just fucking twirl. I love that. Damn it! Who does that jerk think he is? Hey there. You want to be on TV? Oh, brother. Huh? You've got a slamming bot after all. <laughs> Ugh. Uh. I'm on a school trip. Just give me a call if you're interested. I'd greatly welcome a message from you, day or night. Uh, yeah. Greatly welcome my ass. It's obvious what he's after. Yeah. Do these rotten adults care about anything other than looks? I'll yank their stupid hearts out, damn it. Will you quiet down? You're supposed to be acting like good students. I'll rip out their hearts. The stealing her is a rip heart set. your board, but please don't cause any trouble, okay? Ma'am, please. Well, then, uh, I am bored as shit, and like I just want to see. An oh, that stands for assistant camera. When we're moving cameras, we need people who can keep the cables from getting tangled up. The blonde will do. He seems like he's got energy to spare anyway. Guy next to him, you can come too if you're feeling lonely. Come on. Hurry up and grab the cables. Damn it. This sucks. Eesh. Oh, look! Something oh, to do. Fine. Ass. This is totally killing my vibe. <laughs> we fought valiantly against the long cables. <laughs> I'm so pissed off. Aren't we supposed to be guests? Why the hell do we have to be doing manual labor? This is bullshit. I, going to the bathroom didn't even make me feel better. Quiet down, will you? I get how you feel, though. That sucked for the both of us. Oh, we gotta do more of this tomorrow, too? No flaking out, Ryuji. I know, I know. I gotta be a good boy, right? Oh, being Phantom Thieves ain't easy. Gotta be a good boy, pal, pal. From here today, we don't spend much time in this area, so why don't we relax and check out some shops beforehand? Oh, I know a place. I want to go to that huge pancake-looking place we passed on the way here. It looked delicious. Pancakes. I say let's go, cause pancakes. The round part is a baseball stadium. Then along the outside, they've got an amusement park. Ooh. It's right in the middle of a business area, but they have some pretty hardcore rides there, too. All right, let's go. I'll show you just how courageous I am. <laughs> Going on a scary ride doesn't really prove any kind of courage. Not like cats can get on anyways. Really? Really. You might be able to sneak in if you stay in the bag, but you'd totally puke if you did that. But, uh, let's just go to Dome Town. I'm really feeling it now. Amusement park, amusement park, amusement park! Ready for roller coasters. Ah, uh, I think I'll pass on the puke rides. <laughs> Excuse me. 
I couldn't help but notice your uniforms. Are you students of Shujin Academy? Oh, this boy. Hello. What do you want? I happen to be passing by, so it seemed polite to uh, I'm we'll going to pinch together. your oh. cheeks. <laughs> Where are my manners? My name is Goro Akechi. I'm going to pinch your cheeks. Filming. What? You're a celebrity? <laughs> Only to the extent of appearing on TV a couple of times. Oh! My apologies. I truly was just passing by. There's a briefing for tomorrow's recording that I have to attend. So, you're going to go have cake now? I'm... Ah, wait. I missed lunch today, so I'm quite hungry myself. Huh? Cake? What are you talking about? Oh, am I mistaken? I thought I heard something about delicious pancakes. No matter. Well, see you tomorrow. Everyone's... And this is where everyone's gone. Ah, uh, yes. Some kind of start -up entertainer or something. Pancakes. Now this is the Pancake really Man. There, he is Pancake Man. I love him. It's fine. Come it's, on, he's, so, he's so dumb. He's a little silly man. He's a little silly man. Suidobashi. All right. Cool. Hey, can we skip the vomit machines and get cake instead? <laughs> oh boy. I feel like I'm gonna puke. Oh, for real, my stomach's churning. This is why I spoke against it. Oh. Dude, it's not fair using your cat hood as an excuse only at times like way. this. Are you guys feeling hungry? How about some pancakes? She's loving this. We have another full day ahead She's loving this. Well then. You're gonna film us at the TV station tomorrow, right? Try to stand out too much, that's Ryuji's thing. Fair. Oh, we can leave. I forgot that this game lets you leave after things like that. I was stuck in the Persona 5 uh, mentality of, oh, I did something today. I'm not allowed to leave the house now. Uh... I need to do guts, but I, I, well, to, I don't know if the chemi is free. Okay. Hold on. Come on. Hold on. Is the chemi free? Is the chemi free? She's the best way I can get my guts. The chemi. Oh, she's not free. Okay, never mind. I could have a bath, but no, we're more likely to get better equipment. Oh, okay. God, how many sooty stuff do we have? Like, geez. The thing is, we can easily put them in other washing machines. I'm gonna complain each and every time. Because, like, that's what I would do. No one uses these machines. So let's just use all of them. At least two. Oh. It takes, like, half an hour. Old cat collar. Old cat's night collar. Old duke coat. Shikigami dress. Let's head back. Okay. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. Oh, this is coming on. It's a catchy cow. He's so cool. Ain't that the guy from yesterday? Yes, cutting back from commercial. Seven, six, five seconds till start. Four, three, three 
two, one. And now, on to the hottest meet and greet segment of our show. Oh, After his brother. last appearance was so well received, we decided to bring back this fine gentleman today. It's I would be like, oh, school detective brother. Goro Akechi. Hello there. Thank you for taking the time to join us today, Akechi-kun. Your popularity is stunning. Even I found it to be quite a surprise. It is a bit embarrassing, though. Moving along, we've been told there's a case on your mind right now. Care to share, detective? Oh, yes. Tell it would be the scandal involving the master artist. Tell us. <laughs> there it is. All of this phantom thief excitement has caught your attention, too, akechi -kun. Allow me to be blunt for just a second. What do you think of these justice-oriented phantom thieves? If they truly are heroes of justice, I sincerely hope they exist. Oh, so you don't deny the possibility that they're real? I may not seem like it, but I sometimes wish that Santa Claus actually existed. Although, if he did, I'd have to arrest him for breaking and entering. <laughs> it is dumb jokes like that that makes me go, but I want to paint your speaking, cheeks. If these phantom thieves are real, I believe they should be tried in a court of law. For doing what? That's quite the statement. Are they committing crimes? Some people even say that the thieves are actually helping their victims abandon their evil ways. Yeah. What the artist Madarame did truly was an unforgivable crime. Yes. However, they're taking the law into their own hands by judging him. It is far from justice. More we just basically went, hey, confess everything heart. bad you you've done. These people are calling themselves the Phantom Thieves, after all. Uh, cool. Amazing as always, Akechi-kun. I could listen to you for days. You have the most radiant charisma. Hey, confess your sins. Okay, confess his sins. Oh shit, turns out I'm a bad person. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pretty much what's going on. Let's try asking some students the same age as Akechi-kun about the Phantom Thieves. First, Please press your button now if you think the Phantom Thieves exist. Of course they do. About 30% or so. What are your thoughts, Akechi-kun? That's higher than I'm a I bit thought. Surprised. It would be. That's higher than I was expecting. Yeah. Expected. I'd love to hear some more detailed opinions on the Phantom Thieves. Higher than I thought. Eh. All right, let's try asking this student here. Hypothetically speaking, what are your thoughts on these phantom thieves uh. if they were real? <laughs> they do more than the cops. <laughs> they do more than the cops. That's this for fucking sure. It goes against the opinion you had about them being tried by law, Ketchikun. That wait, no, hold on. Indeed. It's rather intriguing to hear such a strong acknowledgement. Oh, don't get me wrong. They should be tried in the court of law. But the thing is, they're doing more than the cops could ever do and even hope to achieve by bringing them to justice when the cops didn't even know about Madarame. But the thieves did, somehow. Confused on that, but whatever. And, you know, basically went, hey, tell everyone your shit. And he did. Cops can't do that. You know. Man. <laughs> In that case, there's one more question I'd like to ask. Shoot it, pretty boy! If someone close to you, for example, your friend next to you, Hi, if Ryuji. his heart suddenly changed, wouldn't you think it was the work of the Phantom Thieves? Um, if he was a horrible person? And then he changed, I suppose? Because currently the Phantom Thieves have only ever done good things, so... You know. They only target... <laughs> what would you think? What would you think? Ah, <laughs> I'm telling you shit. Throwing the question back at me. <laughs> well. This is my opinion on the topic. Whether the thieves' actions are good or not, I feel there is a more important issue at hand. Ow. Mm -hmm. What do you mean? The matter of how they change people's hearts. If they honestly possess that ability, it could be used for more than extracting confessions. 
It could be that what seem to be ordinary crimes are actually being perpetrated by these methods. You know, you're absolutely right. Oh, please don't misunderstand. This is all purely hypothetical. It is only if people who can use such a power truly exist. Either way, though, this cannot be ignored. The existence of the Phantom Thieves would be nothing but a threat to our everyday lives. Changing hearts to be good... I guess you can rearrange it so that you change your heart to be bad? I suppose. Like, if you can go one way, you can go the other. I suppose that makes sense. But still. <laughs> to be honest, I'm already working alongside the police to help sort out this matter. <laughs> it kind of seemed like what he was saying might be right. He made it sound like we're the baddies. I don't like it. That stuff about the police. Do you think it's for real? He can say whatever he wants. The justice of it all is something we can decide for ourselves. Oh, sorry. I, I gotta go take a leak. Can you guys wait here? I'll be right back. Oh my god. I'm gonna keep going, okay? Sorry about that. I inhaled oh, my drink. <laughs> I am currently I dying. I, found you. I wanted to thank you in person. To paraphrase Hegel, advancement cannot occur without both thesis and antithesis. My apologies. What I mean is that our discussion was quite meaningful. Few people around me are so willing to speak their minds as freely as you did earlier. Adults are only interested in using the young. Yep. All they simply do as the adults say. There are too many irresponsible people in these modern times. I can understand why you'd support the <coughs> Phantom Thieves. Uh. Hmm. It's possible that this group is just as you believe, and they are truly acting with good <laughs> intentions. Fuck. Since they have special talents, I assume their hearts must be burning with a sense of justice and duty. But that justice is merely a facade, concealing their lack of true strength. run you're you he acts as if they know them in which clearly they're I uh, can't yeah, no, they wouldn't run oh you really are intriguing I bet you'd make for a worthwhile debate partner on the subject if it's all right with I you, could be a better partner you continue you know. sharing your 